here we're going to practice what are called tap and turns. The point of this exercise is to get her to focus and to understand that when she feels the stimulation, that it means turn around and follow me. Um, so we're using this dog tra and we're, uh, hey, sit. Good. We're using it on uh, probably level, I don't know, three or four out of a hundred. She's pretty sensitive, so she doesn't need much more than that. We're in a pretty high distraction area. We're at a church. Up until now, we've been practicing this in my driveway, so not a lot of distractions. Sit. So what I'm doing, Lila, sit, is I'm put hitting the button when she's not doing what I want, so it's like the leash. We're applying pressure. So here I'm going to pack up, just start walking, and she needs to walk by my side. If she gets in front of me, I turn around as I hit the button, and if she stays walking the other way, I hold the button. As soon as she turns to look at me, I release the button. So here. And then randomly I'm also going to turn. I hope this video turns out okay. I can't see the screen at all because of the sun. <laughs> so notice I'm not using any commands. This is so that she learns to pay attention and focus. Um, and right now I'm just setting up the behavior. I don't care so much where her position is, as long as she's following me and not in front of me. Um, and then I'm going to start adding commands soon. Um, we, this is where we start using the pack up command. Lilith, sit. So here I'm holding, 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 holding. And because she's ignoring me, I'm just going to go up just a little bit. Oops, she's really sensitive, so if I barely even touch the remote, uh, increase the stimulation, she... Hey, pay attention. There you go. Um, yeah, if I barely touch, uh, increase the stimulation at all, she can feel it. She's really sensitive. So here I'm holding the button again, waiting for her to sit, because I didn't tell her she could get up. ignoring this time. Lilith, there you go. You didn't have to go down, but that works. And then I reset the stimulation back to three or four, so I got up to maybe five or six there. Pack up. Pack up. So that's when I start adding the wording. We're not going to do that too much yet, but I just wanted to show you an example of how we do it. So every time I turn, pack up. And every time I turn, I'm tapping the button, saying pack up, and turning at the same exact time. Timing is very important in e-collar training. Back up. There. Okay, so I'm going to stop using the command again. Because if I'm using the command, she's focusing on my voice to tell her what to do, not on paying attention to where I am and what I'm doing, and not to learning that the stimulation means pay attention to me. So, good. Good. There's a lot of people walking around, so... It's really distracting, huh? Did you love people? You're doing brilliantly. So yeah, so that's about it.